Hey guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to install wheel spaces on your car. Today I have got my BMW Turbo. So this is before wheel spaces and this is after. Beamers are a little bit different to your normal jack cars. They actually use bolts instead of lug nuts. So these spaces that I've got here, they are 25mm. I'm going to be bolting these to the hub and then they have studs that stick out. So basically I'm converting my hub from a bolt to a stud. So uh, yeah, let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to do, which you guys don't have to do, is I'm going to paint the spaces black. I'm going to quickly paint them and then I'll be right back. Alright, so I've just cracked the uh, bolts before I jack the car up. Um, and now I'm just going to jack the car up and get the wheel off. So I'm going to add a bit of camber to uh, my coilovers. They've got an adjustment on the top. That's the camber adjustment right there. Just loosen those Allen key bolts and slide it across so that you have more angle. So what I did was take that one and that one out and move them across to the, to the next slot over and push the whole strut that way. Um, which makes the hub tilt more that way, like that. Hey guys, it's Nicole. <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead. <laughs> These are the special lug nuts that I ordered. With these spaces, because they're not hub centric, they don't have the ring in the middle, um, you need to make sure that you tighten the bolts evenly in a star pattern. Otherwise, it, you might tighten it down and it'll be off to the side. So the nuts are tapered, so it should be fine, but make sure you evenly tighten them in a star pattern until they're fully torqued. Once you've tightened them down, make sure that the wheel is sitting on flush with the spacer. Otherwise, you're going to have some pretty bad wheel wobbling. To tighten them fully without the wheel spinning, just jack it down so the wheel just touches the ground. That way, that way the wheel won't spin when you're trying to tighten it. Alright, so I got the front spaces on, they're sitting pretty good now. Now we're going to start on to the backs. The backs are pretty much the same. Just take the wheel off, put the spacer on and then put the wheel back on. But my coilovers are too low, so I'm going to have to raise it a bit. So I've taken the spring out, I've got a spring perch in there, 
So now I'm just going to raise that up a bit so it raises the rear of the car. 